Hey everybody, it's Wave Storm Tracking Team Meteorologist Ryan Hoke with Hokie Weather Facts for June 13th of 2024. This week we're talking about summertime weather and one of the things that often influences our weather is wildfire smoke that we can see overhead. But when you get closer to those wildfires, in fact directly overhead, you can sometimes get the heat from those fires to be so intense that they create their own thunderstorms. Now those thunderstorms, often called pyrocumulonimbus clouds, can be very destructive with more than 100 mile per hour winds below them. So not only do you have the fire causing destruction, but then the thunderstorm above the fire is also causing destructive forces and that's no good either. So those very intense wildfires can make these fire driven thunderstorms. Back here closer to home, we've got a big stretch of 90s coming our way as of this recording. Louisville Muhammad Ali International Airport, which is right square in the middle of the city's urban heat island, sees about 4.4 more days in the 90s than Bowman Field, which is on the eastern edge of that heat island each year. On average, the urban heat island, it's all the concrete and the asphalt and the lack of trees we have in the center of the city creates more heat during the summertime. Whereas the suburbs closer to the Watterson and especially the Snyder uh, freeway there, those areas have a lot more trees, so the heat isn't as bad. The overnight lows are a little lower. The daytime highs are a little lower. So there's a difference between those 90 degree day counts, depending on what part of the city that you're in. That's Hokey Weather Facts for the week. I'm Wave Storm Tracking Team Meteorologist Ryan Hoke.